This is Uncle Momo's music reaction channel where I provide my views on talented artists from around the world, both established artists and non-established artists. And I promise you that you won't be disappointed whatsoever. And today we are going over to Indonesia and checking out Putri Ariani. This is a song cover with Sarah Michelin. And um, when she loves me, I don't know if I've heard this song before from any for anything. So in the description page, when she loves me, Simon McLennan, don't forget to comment, share, and subscribe onto Patreoni on Patreoni's um, sub channel, okay, um, and Instagram and Facebook. So look, we we'll go straight into my second reaction of Patreoni, and this is once again back in 2020. So she's 14. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing. Um, yeah, so look, without further ado, you know what we're here for. Great vocabs and a damn good video or your music. Can you do it? When somebody loved me Everything was beautiful I think I do know the song Every hour spent together Lives within my heart And when she was said I think her mum I was started right here Recorded this one as well And when she was happy so was I When she this is a perfect example of um, child frequency. Um, I've explained this in so many different kind of ways. Child frequency is a note what they hit, which makes you automatically cry. I expect that there's been a hell of a lot of people crying when she sings this song and they don't understand why. She hits these child frequency notes. Um, I don't know how to explain it other than that um but there's certain notes that you just automatically go into tears and there was two notes there that made my body went Whoa, and literally I, I automatically because i recognize it i pulled it back straight in but i'm telling you right back now without no mistake at all that a hell of a lot of people have cried on this song and so i'm just explaining to you what that is <laughs> if you didn't know what that was and what it is. 40 second, 42 seconds in and I'm explaining to you about cry frequencies. I, I'll point them out to you. I'm going to go back to about, say, here. Like, you know what I don't really do. When she loved me Amazing control. We had a child that was all Just she and I together Like it was meant to be And when she was lonely I was there to comfort her Her dad done the mixing, the mastering This is amazing for a Christmas song, even though this was released out in June. This would be perfect Christmas song. So the years went by, I stayed the same. But she began to drift away. I was left alone. That's when she's putting her own mark on it. Still I wait for the day. I love that choke note. No when no she change. Said Frequency. Mm. Lonely and forgotten, never 
I swear this has been a Christmas advert or something. Like she loved me That's the piano clank. When she loved me When somebody loved me Everything was beautiful Every hour spent together Lives within my heart. Every when word she loved me. So that was Pucci Ariani's song cover of Sarah. Sarah McCallion, and uh, when she loved me, this also feels like a a male vocal song. This being a song before, I recognise the chord changes in a number of adverts as well. So it's kind of like, have I heard this song or not? And I believe that I have, but I'm not too sure if it was Sarah that sung it. Pucci Ariani at 14 year olds uh, singing this song, crystal clean, clear. And then halfway through it, as you know, well, three quarters of the way, as you know, she puts her own stamp on it, puts her person, person, her persons onto it. Um, she's explained it so many times that she's listens to a song and finds a way how she how she wants to interpret it, the way how she makes it feels, and she goes back into memory state and then finds that connection. Then she executes, uh, and then you see the the comfort stage of how and the comfort tr stage when she tr um, tributes this song. Because she's got this picture, i.e. also she's got the artist in, in kind as well. And she always follows that same schematics, even to the age of 17 years old right now. And you can see the lovely maturity growth between her at 14 to where she is right now at 17. It's lovely. It really is. Because you see here, for me, a... A little lamb. I'm not no not saying that she's shy or whatever, but I'm saying a little lamb what is what I'm seeing here. Now, 17, you're seeing a goat. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? And she's rocking with the best, collaborating with the best. Like she's can't wait to express how she feels about that artist and the reason why she really wants to do that collaboration with her. I just reacted to her doing the Alan Walker when she was 14. And you can see the smile on her face as when she actually finally meets Alan Walker and does that interview. You go to my um, community page, uh, not community page, go to my playlist, Indonesian playlist, and you see the interview that, I, um, that she did with Alan Walker, um, of Alan Walker. So she's got these amazing catalogues in her mind. And some of these artists pick out and she's like, I can't wait to meet this particular artist. And she's at the platform in her life where she has those chances so it's like speaking is for me it's like Pichiriani 17 speaking to a 15 year old self and saying um, 14 year old self and saying look where we are now <laughs> can you imagine this can you imagine that you're doing something and then five years later you are actually meet or you know whatever man, years three whatever um, years later you are actually sitting down with that person talking to that person and you expressing to that person how you feel about that person and what how you've grown up with that person and that's what she's you're seeing in her interviews. I don't know if she's seen sorry or not. Um, but I'm sure that there's going to be, in a vast amount of catalogues of music that she has in her mind, there must be a vast amount of artists that she can't wait to meet. And the excitingness is that she has now the opportunity to do so. And hats off as well to mum and dad, who've been there thick and thin every single step. And this is a trophy for you as well as um, Pucci Ariani to, um, for you guys to share. As a whole family as well. And I've explained that to my, in my um, Alan Walker reaction as well. And it's really, really nice. It really is. I'm so glad that I'm going back. And I'm going to continue to go further back as well um, to watch his Pucci Ariani. And just having that kind of balance of 
the space of she, when she done this to where she is now. It really is nice. You have so many catalogs and songs to do, so I'm being here for a really, really long time. Until next time, I salute you. Boom! Every hour spent together. Live.